presents a horror sixteen production. Welcome, everyone, to TWAR's Playroom. We are live at a local McDonald's in somewhere in New Jersey. The following rehash is a sexy boy butt buddy solitary confinement match. Just guess who is in this match. Whoops, he's the wrong thing. Coming down the slide. At a total combined weight of 648 pounds. Injured man. Injured you, an injured superhero. Whoa. Well, this event couldn't even afford fireworks. And there is the first comment of the night from my broadcast colleague Mark Adams. Man looks like he's in prime condition to compete. And their opponents at a total combined weight six hundred and fifty four pounds. Captain Al And apparently this is taking place in an Elimination Chamber match. Once again, unadvertised. There's a pin. One, two, three. Looks like Injured Man is eliminated from the bout already. What is Captain Al-Qaeda doing? <laughs> Injured Man was just eliminated! Why is he back in the ring? I don't understand this at all. And there's a DDT. Injured dude. The guy is such an idiot, he forgot to come out. Injured man was laying on the ground. Frankly, he should be gone. He has been eliminated from this bout. There's the pin. One, two, three. And if I'm correct, Injured Dude has been eliminated too. So logically, there should only be one left. But Injured Man has not left the building yet. Now the next countdown begins. And it's henchman number one making his way. Looks like the balls are in Captain Al-Qaeda's court. 
he just struck his own henchmen. Why do you do that? And now, Captain Al Qaeda uses his opponent to strike his own partner. This makes just about as much sense as Inception. The next countdown begins. There can only be one man. Oh, sorry. Injured superhero. He's the only one left for his team. Even though injured man refuses to take a hint and leave the building. If injured superhero is from Texas, or Kentucky, excuse me, why is he wearing a British cape? An injured superhero has been pinned. Therefore, Captain Al-Qaeda wins the match for his team. Captain Al-Qaeda and his two lookalikes. Yikes. Once again, the injured men cannot beat Captain Al-Qaeda and his posse.